Hey guys, it is me, my little short line trains, and I would just like to go over some of my personal favorite um trains out there. So I'm trying, I'm trying to make the videos so of the wooden trains, but I'm trying to figure out this editing software. So for now, I'm just gonna do a couple of views, and if I can get it figured out, then I'll start posting about the wooden trains. So I'll just like I just like to go over some of my personal favorite trains and I'll get over to that right now. So I hope you guys are having a good day. So let me just go over for the um my favorite types of wooden trains. Let's go with number one. So my first um favorite train is are intermodal trains. Now I only have four intermodal cars, that could be a lot or that could be a little. But I'm still trying to save up uh, for other uh, intermodal cars so I can have a complete intermodal train. And for me to com have a complete intermodal train, I need three more um, intermodal cars. And that's the blue CSX intermodal, the um, gray CSX intermodal, and the K-Line and Evergreen mix intermodal. So four plus three, that's seven, obviously. So just if I had seven cars, yes, that'd be a f I would count that as a full intermodal train. So, I have the CNW GP38-2 hooked up to it. And, yes, they're not always loaded. But, my favorite one is probably the K-Line car, or the K-Line containers. Because, when I am uh, drive, I drive down to Council Bluster's the train shows. So, I usually see those. And, I just love to see intermodal trains. I love when I'm driving down, and probably for like three hours straight, I uh, there's railroad tracks right next to uh, me. So whenever a train comes, I keep looking down and the trains come flying by. It's just so cool to see them. Uh, just really cool to see them come flying by, honking the horns. Like the horn just comes like, it's like you can't barely hear them. It's right there in your face and gone like in an instant. And it's just really cool to watch fast trains and the wind and the noises. So that's why I love intermodal trains. They're really tall. So that's why the intermodal train is one of my favorite trains. My next um, favorite trains are coal trains. Now this is an empty coal train. I do have quite a few coal cars. And I love when uh, I watch a coal train come by, if it's loaded, I always watch the coal fall off and I grab it and I pay it off and I actually keep it to collect it. So anyways, uh, I just love the coal cars and as you can see, I've been collecting them, and I don't think, I don't have all of them. I mean, I I know there's one I don't have, and that's the Burlington Northern coal car. I don't know if there's more or not, but, yeah, I don't know if there's more or not. But, those, so far, I know, all I know is the BN coal car, because I have the Norfolk Southern, CP Rail, CSX, UP, Santa Fe, and Canadian National. And I am I believe that's all of them, except for Burlington Northern. That's the green one. So, that's the only one I have. And so, I just need to uh, get the just get that one. I think I would have a complete coal train. It'd be cool to get some more coal, coal loads because I only have one. So, I would just like to get more because they're just really cool to have coal train, have them come really fast by so i just love coal trains i love how loud they are and i just love trains personally like yeah just everything about them i just love them so that's the number that's the second type of train i like and i will now move on to the third one next are passenger trains now i only have a couple engines and still i'm super surprised that i have the amtrak at 40 ph so um, I'm just super glad that I got it because I've been trying to, sorry about that. I'll be right back. Sorry. I just had a mistake. Hold on. Sorry. Uh, I had technical difficulties. I'm sorry. So anyways, uh, I love passenger trains and, uh, I just love to make them. So I only, I got my dream to have two F40s and uh, I really would love an other Amtrak. That'd be so amazing. So I got an Amtrak like that, and that like that, and that was an Amtrak, so that'd be boss. So, what I'm trying to do is uh, get find another Amtrak. I'm hoping to find one. And now, I do have the, I uh, can't remember what these are called, the uh, types. 
because I usually don't focus on them. But he, I, this is my first Amtrak engine ever. And I used to only have one passenger car with it, which I didn't, I was like, uh, I need to get more cars, but I never really did because I was more worried about getting freight cars. So, um, this is, I used to have only one, and this is the only car that it came with. That's the only car that it came with. So, I collected more, and then I got this for last year's Christmas, and I got two passenger cars with that. Then this Christmas, I got that, I got that, um, F40, and I got five passenger cars, which gave me eight, so that was, that was amazing when I got that. So, these are all my cars I got. These are my, uh... Those are my five coach cars right there, and I believe this one's a streamliner because, as I think you know, you should know, but Amtrak, they didn't want um, Little Short Line to uh, make their company anymore, so Little Short Line made their own um, company, so it was streamlined instead of Superliner, so I got two of these. Let me find the other one, and here's the other one. Got the other Superliner, but these are all coaches right here. These are Coach cars, my suit. Those are my super liner ones, and so yeah, I'm very excited that I have those. And I'll show them like all flipped over. And here, this this would be better here. Let me flip them all over. Okay, so I thought this would be better. So there are my two streamliner cars, my two streamliner coach cars. They won't focus. Okay, those are my three uh, super liner coach cars. And now, next, this is the first passenger car I really actually had. And I never, I never knew that this was a dining car until, like, a couple weeks ago. Because I never really focused on what it said. And the reason why, it's like, just trust me, I did not chip it up like this. And this was a used one. So, I could tell it was a used one because of all that paint chipped off right there. It came with this. And I would never ever do this with this color on it and stuff and i just really don't like it i'm not i really didn't like how it had that color but you know amtrak was gone at that time so i was still really i'm still really happy about it and moving on here are my uh two sleeping cars right here my two super liner sleeping cars you can see right there this actually came with the amtrak f40 ph so those two and these three passenger cars came with this Amtrak F40 PH. They were all in one set. And so that was pretty, it's pretty fun to see those. And now a WSRR 20, uh, 2115. So I would look, I was actually looking forward for John Henry because it had the um, red, white, and blue, just like the Amtrak, because I never thought I'd get an Amtrak. So I was wanting that but i didn't and i still don't care at least i have an f40 ph and, and i'm still really psyched about that so there's not really uh, much to say about it it's still in good hands it's i've had it for a year and i mean there's still there's some um chips in it and i'm trying to keep them safe because i just got some new containers to have them in safer places so this um really helped my uh uh, passenger car collection so yeah these are my passenger trains and i just really love them now let's move on to my uh fourth one next up on my uh favorite trains are grain trains and i only have three cars and these are my two recent grain trains oh yeah and about this car and i know how i said um second to win or second to win and it's neither of those so i got corrected by my father he said that it was saskatchewan and I'm not sure if it is, so if you guys would uh, let me know in the comments below, that'd be amazing. So, yeah, these are my two most recent um, green cars. Got these, uh, like, just a week before these came in. So, this is my UP Center Flow. I just love having this. I just really wanted it when I saw it on there. So, yeah, I'll be right. So, hold on. Never mind. Okay, so anyways, uh, I have my green train here. I just love this color, so I really wanted it really bad. I would have gotten a different car, like a cylinder car, uh, like the Canadian National Rainbow. But um, this was the only one in stock, so I was like, okay, let's just have this one because it's still really cool. I love the flowers on it, and I love the font. So, yeah, and this is my other center flow, uh, the ACF center flow. So, yeah. Um... I'm not sure what to talk about. I'm getting short in this video, so I'm kind of speeding it up. And, yeah, I only have one more. Uh, just two more. No, yeah, two more. I'll just put them all together. 
So, yeah, those are my green cars, and I just love green trains. So, here are my next ones. So, my next one is the Union Pacific Autorack. And I'd really like an Autorack train, but uh, this is my only one. I don't know why I haven't been collecting them. So, yeah, this is my Union Pacific Autorack. It's my favorite. And all the other ones are out of stock. The CSX one was, and the Burlington Northern one was. So, yeah, so... I just got these lumber cars, so these are all part of the um, thing I got for Christmas. And I actually opened these on Christmas Eve because I go to my grandparents' house and we have like a humongous party with my uh, family. So yeah, those are my cars. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. And I'd love if you subscribe and if you uh, um, please leave a like. So. Yeah, this is these, these are my uh, wooden trains. Here are all my yard. Here's my whole yard with some stuff in the way. So I guess I'll see you guys later, and bye.